Welcome, welcome. We are here uh, at the Post Navigate Her uh, award ceremony. Uh, we believe in the power of giving back and how important that is. And so uh, on October 2nd and 3rd, we held uh, the Navigate Her Women's Leadership Conference 2020. And um, our nonprofit of choice was Ladder House Decor. And the reason why we chose them is because we really, really, really appreciate the work that they do uh, around domestic violence and being able to help people that have been in a shelter on the run uh, kind of restore their life. And so Shalonda Wagner, it is her ministry. It is what she does. And she's here tonight and we're going to present her with a portion of the proceeds from the Navigate Her Women's Leadership Conference 2020. So I'm going to turn it over to Shalonda so that Shalonda could tell you a bit more and how to get in contact with her and how to donate to her ministry. Shalonda Wagner. Yay! Thank you so much, Zandra, again, for your continued support and for selecting us to um, be the nonprofit of choice for the Navigate Her conference 2020. It has truly just been a whirlwind of emotions and thanksgiving and just being a part of something great like this and you opening up that door of opportunity has truly blessed us tremendously. Just the exposure alone has truly blessed us. So Ladder House Decor was derived from Haggai 2 and 9 where it says in the word of God the latter house will be greater than the former house and in this place I will provide peace. As a survivor turned advocate I knew that there was something I had to do for survivors of domestic violence to um, become a humanitarian, to be someone who just didn't sit behind the scenes but actually got in there to play the game of life to help people restart their lives after a traumatic season. And sometimes those seasons last for years, 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 and years until that survivor, till that victim who turns survivor to say, you know what, I'm done, I'm out of here. My kids' lives mean more to me than me being um, scolded and molded into something that I know that I, I am not and being controlled. So Ladder House was birthed out of counseling, if you can believe that. I was sitting in counseling, and I some, all of our domestic violence issues were different. But one thing was common that every woman in that room mentioned, we could not leave with anything. So that was my story, too. I could not leave with anything because I had to flee from the person who was trying to hurt me. And I had to take my child and just a few clothing items and get out and get safe. And so with that, I began to volunteer while I was in um, women's counseling and my local church began to just give me home decor and furnishings at no charge, just free. They said, you, you have this. This will not be a part of our garage sale. So you take this with you, take it home, put it somewhere, make a life for yourself. And so that's what literally the Holy Spirit whispered into my ear and said, that's what you're going to do for survivors of domestic violence. You are going to offer them no cost interior decorating home uh, design. And that's what I've been doing since 2015. And we have decorated over 30 homes. <laughs> Yay, by the grace of God. So um, I am so excited. So, so thankful. Well, we are excited for you uh, and we want it to be a blessing uh, to you. Uh, it, it, just that is so kind of selfless. Like you, you're just giving. You're, the whole principle around Ladder House is giving. And so I just applaud you uh, for the excellent work that you're doing. If people wanted to donate to your ministry, how could they donate uh, to help yet another woman that, um, you know, uh, through their domestic violence situation? Yes, thank you so much for allowing us to share our giving, um, the ways to give. You can log on to our website, which is Ladder House Decor, that's L-A-T-T-E-R, H-O-U-S-C, decor.org. Hit the donate tab and it takes you right to our giving portal. You can give any dollar amount. A lot of people think that, well, I don't have five or $10 or $20 to give. If you could understand how much silverware means to someone who doesn't have silverware, plates, bath towels and face towels to wash their face, that $10, that $5 that you could give one time or monthly is hugely important because 
those are the things that they need to transition with when they leave the shelter. And we work with three shelters currently right now in the Dallas Metroplex. So go on to that, um, our website, ladderhousedecor.org, hit the donate tab and you can give straight there. You can almost also email us at ladderhousedecor at gmail.com. It's just like the ministry name, ladderhousedecor at gmail.com. And if you have a decor or home furnishing item and say, I don't want this chair anymore, I don't want this dining table anymore, donate it to us, send us a picture of it, and you and we can find out if that'll be good for the next family that we serve. So there are several ways to give, and I thank you so much. That's so awesome. And I'll drop uh, that information uh, in the text box when I... Um, you know, when we finish this video, because I want you all to be able to donate to this ministry if you would like. We've got a couple of people that are on the line um, <laughs> that I would like to introduce. Uh, and then I'm going to present Shalanda with uh, our donation. So Tiara, you want to introduce yourself and what you do? Can't hear you. Hello, everybody. My name is Tierra M. Tucker, and I'm the founder and CEO of Tierra Public Relations Network, as well as Speak That Movement. So I'm honored to be here to witness this amazing organization uh, receive such a beautiful honor. And I'm blessed and grateful for all that you do, and I hope you continue doing what you're doing. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Tierra. <laughs> you're amazing. And then we have Michelle MacArthur. Hi, Tiara. How are you, honey? Well, hi, um, Shalonda. This is so nice to meet you. I've seen you um, when it was on Navigate, and you are doing some awesome things. I'm really excited. Also, with um, Dallas Professional Women, um, this is really exciting and just different ventures. Well, but my name's Michelle MacArthur, and I am the founder and CEO for MacArthur Accommodations. We are a hospitality, health, and wellness um, coaching and consulting, and I'm also the president for Holistic Herbal Health, which is a Chinese herbal uh, medicine uh, clinic and dispensary, and together we um, specialize in creating immunity for life, and I think this is going to be great. Um, I have on the off side is a um, nonprofit that's called Holistic Aid Foundation and very philanthropic about helping people. So your organization with getting different things and having snapshots and stuff um, is going to be great as well. I don't know. Do you have a web um, on the Facebook? Do you have like that for posting or do you like to filter it first? Um, as far as um, I got a dining room table instead of just having it posted or something, for example, do you yeah. like to see what the dining room table is before you kind of got it? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you can inbox us on Facebook or send an email either way. So people, we get inboxes all the time on our Facebook business page. And, you know, we say, yes, we've loved it. We, you know, we'll find a way to pick it up or if the person can drop it off. That's great too. Well, this is going to be good because with um, uh, DPW um, and it's going to be kind of just go out and, you know, for with sharing it and everything. So I really want to, we'll, we'll get a good system set up between Iram and myself and uh, really to see how we can uh, really start um, filling up, you know, what you need that you're going to be like, I am overflowing and, you know, just so yeah. with growing. Yay, we love that. We love to have inventory like right there on the shelf, like a staging company, you know, or, you know, a, an interior decorating company to know that we could just have comforter sets and, and chairs and tables and all of that, like in our um, storage facility already prepared, you know, we wouldn't have to con con constantly come on social media and say, do you have this or do you have that or do you have those things? And with those things like fully stocked, that just truly blesses our process. We can just go straight in and not have as many delays and you no know, two to three weeks down the line. We could get to them within a week and a half or something like that. Well, and the other thing that comes through, um, and I, I promise I, I won't say anything else, Zondra. It's like you <laughs> give me an opportunity to talk and y'all know, but is Arms of Hope. 
There's another organization called Caring and Sharing. And both of those have like these um, outlets and uh, two um, called Medina's, um, Medina, um, it's the ch children's home and Boyles, which is the uh, orphanage. And it's about helping. And I really see that many times they are like, okay, we don't need, um, we don't need any more couches. We don't need. And so when they're like overflowing and Arms of Hope has the trucks and they've got like the boxes all over now because it's really growing. Um, but I think that that's going to be a, okay, well, um, Shalanda's group, wait, you know, she's going to, let's, let's let anything that's overflowing, let's get it over instead of going to, I don't know, Salvation Army or something, and I'm kind of just thinking out loud, you know, that way I can, um, I'll talk to the main executive directors and say, hey, what can we do? This is like the other organization that I'd really like to filter that, if that works for you. Oh my gosh, if you could only see what's on the inside of my head, it's like exploding, like, yes, yes, yes. I mean, you know, and that's okay. it, you know, um, Tiara knows where my brain usually goes all in some different ways, and so does Sandra. But that's kind of where I'm thinking, because when the Lord comes in, it's like all things are always possible. And th those are just to name a few. I mean, when I talk about Boyles and Medina, and they're out east, okay? But um, this Arms of Hope, and then there's another organization called Christian Care, and that's in the adoption, like, you know, so you've got families that, that are in need. So there, I'm sure the Lord will kind of put some other things once we start, uh, you know, digesting everything we talked in. I'm so sorry that um, my other meeting um, held me a little bit, but I already knew enough from your organization. So I'm just super excited about us really working together and just having this opportunity to serve. That's awesome. So you, awesome. All are so, you all are amazing women. I love it. All of the women that uh, participated in Navigate Her were amazing. You may be thinking, uh, why is not my partner uh, here tonight? Well, Jackie Robinson, who is the CEO of She Boss Unlimited, I always call her the she boss of the she bosses. Uh, had another engagement tonight, but I didn't want October uh, to leave uh, out this month and not present you with what we have for you. I don't even think I introduced myself. For those of you that don't know me, I'm Zondra Evans, and I'm the founder and owner of Zondra TV Network here in Dallas, Texas. And um, we were just elated to be able to adopt uh, Shalanda and the Ladder House uh, for this event. And so I'm going to share my screen real quick. And I want to say, um, before I share my screen, uh, Shalanda, we, 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 we want to present you with a $300 check. And I know it, that, that don't sound like a whole bunch of money. Um, but given uh, this was the first year um, that we actually uh, did navigate her, uh, this is a, a you know, we, we want to give 10% back to whatever we do. And so this kind of represents uh, that 10% donation back to, um, to the, um, to the uh, nonprofit. Um, it, it costs a little bit more, you know, for us to do the things that we had to do. But um, we believe that next year we're going to uh, double this amount, if not triple this amount, um, given some of the partnerships and collaborations that we've got set for uh, next year. Uh, also, uh, I wanted to say that, um, Shalanda, the things that Michelle was talking about is really a lot of power. Um, there's so much power in association and, and collaboration. And so the more that you could get in front of other audiences and let them know of the good work that you're doing, then the more possibilities and your dreams really can come true because this is something that you're doing from your heart, even based on you having your own situation and then feeling like, you know, the thing to do was to develop this nonprofit. We're extremely proud of you. Uh, I feel blessed to know you. The first day I met you, I was like, oh my goodness, I like fell in love with you. So please accept our uh, donation of $300 on behalf of Navigate Her uh, Women's Leadership Conference uh, 2020. Yay! Yay! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Woo! Won't he do it? <laughs> yes, he, yes, he will. Yes, he will. So oh we are excited. Uh, we're just excited. So you and I talked about the process. We'll get that all done. 
And then, um, you know, like I told you before, uh, you really do align very well with the things that we like to be able to support um, in the community. And so next year, there's yet another opportunity. And so we're excited about uh, partnering and collaborating with you, Shalanda. You're a woman of excellence and you have such a great mission um, that we just love and support you in anything. And moving forward, you have a whole tribe of women now. You know, all of the speakers, all of the panelists, we're here for you. If you need something, don't you ever hesitate to step forward and ask. The reason why we don't have is because we ask not. Amen. Okay. Amen and amen. Yes, amen. I will do that. Amen, amen. <laughs> all right, well, I tell you what, I thank you. I thank you all for jumping on. I know it's a Friday night, uh, but I appreciate each and every one of you that jumped on this uh, call to present uh, Ladder House Decor and Shalonda Wagner with our token of just appreciation for the work that she's doing. So thank you again, Shalonda. Thank you, Tiara. And thank you, Michelle. And you all have a really great weekend. Uh, well, you ladies too. God bless you all. Yes. All right. Yes, thank, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye, guys. Bye. Uh-huh. Bye-bye.